now we'll get back to a new poker Wednesday guys and I get a new video for you. Today I will be strongly reviewing what I've seen from Pokemon The Act of Armor so far. Because I've played a little, like I watched all those accessories and dresses and so on. I can totally say that's not my case. Uh, but I'm gonna come to that later. And I'm gonna give my opinion on all of the Pokemon because I made a series like concentrating on those Pokemon. And yeah, I don't want to talk this long, so I would say let's get started. Yeah, at first, I already mentioned that with the dresses and the jackets and so on. It's not my case. But not because the items are bad, just because I hate dressing up. Like, even in real life, I don't like them. <laughs> like, I really don't care. But the items itself are pretty good. Like, it's, for example, Marnie Inspire. Like, you can totally dress up like her. And the hair sets are good. I mean, not counting the Marnie one because that's like different whether you like it or not, and you're gonna like it or not. Um, the hairstyles they are okay, but there is one I really don't like, like this one where it's the short hair. Like, what is that? Like, I really don't like this one, but this is just what I'm saying. Yeah, I tried through all of um the accessories and so on. I in the end had. Zero poke dollars left because I bought everything. Everything from the expense because I bought everything. <laughs> and yeah. They're pretty good actually, so nothing to complain about. Alright. The Pokemon. This is maybe the like I can't say worst, but it's gonna be the most interesting one, I guess. Because I just like I said I made a series about those Pokemon and I have to say Um It's not really equal. Like, for example, we have six Pokemon from Hone Region, and, and I think it was 34 from Kanto. If you want to see a whole list about all of the Pokemon, I'm gonna uh, give a link to Poketips. Uh, Woody about this because he listed like all of the Pokemon. If you want to see that, then uh, check the link in the description out or info card. I don't know. <laughs> Miss Kitty, what are you gonna do? And <laughs> uh, yeah, like, I think the Pokemon. Is pretty, I think how they chose it is pretty good. Like, it's something from everything. And we didn't really get a Pokemon that was on my list for a Pokemon we don't want. Like, there weren't too many bug types or boring water types or normal types. Like, it was cool. Like, we didn't get a single Pokemon of um, those we don't want, like, from the video. So, I'm pretty happy about this, actually. I'm nearly... Um, yeah, I had a few Pokemon, right, and actually, uh, which Pokemon we'll get. I was wrong with, um, yeah, also a few ones. I think it was six right and four wrong, so it's more than 50-50, and that's actually pretty good. But in the end, it was, like, Pokemon I've seen on the, uh, the game that, well, inside, I was like, oh my god, I should have thought of them, and just, yeah, you know, normal stuff. Um, yeah. So, I'm pretty satisfied with the Pokemon we got. I'm really looking forward to shiny and all of that, because like, I'm gonna do that. <laughs> So yeah, pretty satisfied with that one. The most important part of this video are basically looking at the eyes of armor and so on. And you should have heard me when I first played and first got into like uh, the eyes of armor. I was like, OMG, this is awesome. Like, <laughs> what I said most was pretty much awesome. <laughs> and yeah, that's what I think. It's awesome. Like, it looks pretty good. Like. I'm unsure yet what I want to think the concept of having it just as a wild area is good or bad. And I have to say, I haven't played the story yet. Like, I haven't started with, like, I just walk around everywhere. I haven't started with the story. That's why I can't say anything about this. But what I've seen from the trailer, and yeah, it should be pretty good. And what I've seen from Avery. Yeah, I got Pokemon Shield, so I'm playing with Avery. And actually, I'm pretty happy about this. <laughs> I don't know, I just don't like Clarence too much. It's just like, I think it's something else with a Pokeball floating around his head. It's something else, so I can live with that. <laughs> and yeah. Like, it's actually really awesome. Like, if you get there first, everything, and you see it, and there was so many Pokemon and so much to explore, and oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I could say it again, awesome. I will make an update on my opinion later on, like in one week or two, when I actually threw with the story. And yeah, I'm gonna make a little review of how it evolved with the, especially the wide area, because I really don't know what to think of this. Like, other one, I could be bad, because it's like, it's not really something else. Like, it's 
all the same. Like, you can just drive around through the grass and catch those Pokemon. But on the other hand, you can uh, turn the camera, you can go wherever you want. And this is something I really think is good. But, yeah, I will make a video about how it evolved throughout the story. <laughs> because this is what we can expect for the Chrome Thunder. And I have to say one thing. Like, honestly, this is what I've, what I've been wondering from the moment the very first trailer came out. Why is Skyrim in the Chrome Thunder? The boy has a double weakness to ice. And it's in the ice CLT. What the hell is going on? <laughs> like, Nintendo, like, uh, you know, Game, Game Freak just forgot for a second about the weaknesses and stuff. And just thought Skyrim was an ice-type Pokemon. I really don't know. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna make a separate video about that one too because this is a super interesting question because I really don't know that. So yeah, this was just some sort of very very short opinion on what I've seen so far about the DLC. I hope you will enjoy it if, if you bought it. I mean if you buy it till I think it was the 31st of August you get some special clothing with a Pikachu and an Eevee on top of it. So yeah, that's actually it for today, guys. So I would say have a nice day and bye!